right here in low Earth orbit, a new kind of battlefield is being built piece by piece. And the price tag? Three and a half billion dollars. And no, this isn't for a mission to Mars or some new space telescope. This is an investment in defense. That funding is for the next phase of the proliferated warfighter space architecture. It's a project from the U.S. Space Development Agency, you know, the SDA. You can think of it as a new shield in the sky, a massive constellation of hundreds of satellites, all built for one single critical purpose. And just look at who's building it. The contracts for these 72 new satellites were split between the big defense giants like Lockheed Martin and Northrop Grumman, but also for the first time as a prime contractor on a deal this big, Rocket Lab. Now, this is a major shift. A new space company is now at the very heart of America's orbital defense, proving they are way more than just a launch provider. They're an end-to-end -end prime contractor. And make no mistake, these satellites are not just passive observers. The old way of doing things was about warning. These new constellations, they're designed for tracking and targeting, specifically going after hypersonic missiles that are just too fast and unpredictable for older systems. They create a sensor web so precise it can guide an interceptor to its target from space. The kill chain now starts in orbit. So this raises a huge question. How is one nation building this complex architecture so quickly? 